Today we're following up on the software conversion of Fusion 360 libraries. I'm talking code, .NET, C Sharp, XML, and JSON. Stay tuned. In the last video, I said I'd come back to the sideloading of libraries. Well, here we are, and technically it's not sideloading. It's actually a simple conversion between two protocols, but does it really matter? Mm, no. So when I started my evaluation of HSM Advisor, one of the shortcomings was it didn't import Fusion 360 libraries. I reached out to the developer about it. He said he was working on it, but it'll take some time. So I decided on writing and sharing a tool to import them as part of my last video. And wouldn't you know, just as I finished the tool, he reached out and said he had finished the import feature in the latest release. So yeah. By that time, I had already shared my code up on GitHub, and at this point, it really didn't make sense to include it in the video. So today, I'm going to share a tool that I created, which will convert Fusion 360 tool libraries that are exported as in the JSON format over into the HSM Advisor XML format. Not that you need it, but this is otherwise throwaway work, and if you can benefit from it, by all means. So the first thing I did to tackle this project was to export the library in XML format from HSM Advisor, and then export the Fusion 360 library in JSON format. Those are the most platform agnostic protocols that they each support. With the files in hand, I then compared the schemas to determine how they would map to one another, of which it helps to be familiar with and refer to the software interfaces just to understand how the fields relate to one another and to the schema, of course. Once I understood the mapping of the fields, I dove into Visual Studio 2019 to make a WinForms app. Sure, this could have been done in any technology. I'm just familiar with and enjoy working with WinForms for creating quick tools. So as part of the solution, I added a single WinForm, a few input buttons, and then dove into the code behind the button click events. Disclaimer, normally I would abstract out all the logic and data access code, but since this was just a quick and dirty conversion tool, lots of corners were cut. So don't grade me on it. For the logic, I spin up a reference schema of the HSM Advisor library from the XML format. Then I load up an instance of the Fusion library export that was in JSON format. I then iterate over the Fusion 360 tools, creating them in the HSM Advisor schema object. And once that's done, I save off the HSM Advisor XML doc and give some feedback to the user. A little more code was added to check field values and conditions and prevent some possible errors. I also added the ability to break out Fusion library tools based on their vendor name or using a shared library name for the HSM Advisor library that's generated. And that's it. That's the core logic. Pretty simple, right? And the final conversion tool looks like this. As mentioned earlier, the source code is up on my GitHub along with compiled release that you're welcome to install and use, as well as I've put a link in the comments below. The only difference between this and HSM Advisor's new import capability is he used the HSM lib format, which is different than the JSON format, as well as my tool allows the ability to split tools by vendor name, which is kind of nice. Anyway, that's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed the quick and dirty overview of something completely different, a small software project. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button and ring that notification bell. It'll help keep you in the know on future updates. If you like this particular video and you want to see more, give a thumbs up. That's kind of how this platform works. In the meantime, be safe, have fun, and I can't wait to see you next time. I'm going to go get my code on. Hey, if you like the video, please subscribe to the channel. It's how we're building the community. Also, allow me to bring better content. Also, check me out on these other social networks. There's lots of cool stuff there, too. We're in. It thinks I'm Falcon.